So you can see the trails, the hills, how they roughened up the, uh, the environment. On this sunny afternoon, crews from several agencies fan out in South Haven Park and other spots looking for ATVs in the Pine Barrens. We have over six different police agencies. And we're looking for these illegal ATVs which shouldn't be out there. Steve Rosna is a park ranger. I'm down here three, four times a week. The other day I was down here, there was a uh, dirt bike came down. I followed him and then he spun around and uh, exited the park at an unsafe speed. Art Penzik, the deputy director of the Suffolk County Park Rangers, says using ATVs here can be dangerous and it's bad for the environment. And when they catch people, the penalties are serious, even criminal. If they're cornered on the first offense, it's usually just going to cost them a lot of money. A second conviction, like I say, can turn criminal. They can go to jail for 16 days, lose their ATV, and pay a large fine. Besides patrols, the county has fences and barricades throughout the park to block off some of these trails. You can see this one's been ripped up, and they say as fast as they put these up, someone comes by and rips them down. Officials say riders will go just about anywhere, but they have a piece of advice. Ride at a legal place. Upstate, there's a couple parks on the island still. But they're not allowed on public land in Suffolk County. At South Haven Park, Holly Hare, News 12, Long Island.